I'm Fox 4's Naples community correspondent Mahmoud Bennett. A prominent civic leader here in Naples has died. John Pasadomo, the husband of Florida Senate President Kathleen Pasadomo, was in an accident during a trip to Utah this week. Today, leaders in Naples are bidding farewell. They were our neighbors, and uh, my heart goes out to them. An outpouring of support this week after the sudden death of longtime Naples civic leader John Pasadomo. He fell during a hiking trip in Utah on Wednesday. He was airlifted to a regional trauma center with serious injuries, but did not survive. John Pasadomo was 72 years old, and this year he and his wife would have celebrated their 45th wedding anniversary. Well, I think we're all shocked because we've We've all known John for a long time. Eileen Connolly Kiesler is the president and CEO of the Collier Community Foundation, where Pasadomo served as chairman in the 90s. She says his help laid the groundwork for their success today. You know, he's been a, a person we could go to, brainstorm with, talk to about issues and problems in the community. And he was such a caring and gentle person. Um, it is really sad. And, you know, our hearts certainly go out to Kathleen and the whole family because um, they're going to miss him and this community is going to miss him. Mr. Pasadomo was a longtime and well-known figure in Naples. In addition to serving on city council in the 90s, he was a respected attorney in Collier County, practicing law for more than 40 years. Shocked. Um, very sad. Very tragic. Naples Mayor Teresa Heitman says Pasadomo was a familiar face in the area and knew this city more than most people. Well, he was a council member. He was a vice mayor. He was on PAB. Uh, he was the attorney who helped start the CRA. Uh, he really, I would say, was uh, the brains and the hard work um, uh, in the development in this area. Right up until his passing, Mr. Pasadomo was working as a real estate lawyer at Cheffy Pasadomo. In a statement to Fox 4, the firm's leader described him as a blessing. Quote, he brightened and enriched the lives of people he worked with, and he made our community a better place. Most of all, I admired and respected his relationships with and devotion to Kathleen and their three daughters. Farewell to a great man, a charming gentleman, a commanding presence, a class act, and a life well lived. In a post on X, Kathleen shared their last photo together, thanking the community for an outpouring of love, support, and kind words. Reporting in Naples, Mahmoud Bennett, Fox 4.